Hello YouTube. One of my many subscribers, all 135 of them, noticed my in another video that my bed leveling screws are a little different. Other people have made similar uh, similar uh, uh, modifications. And if I can get this to focus, I can point out what I did. I put on the usual yellow springs that are uh, firmer and uh, don't compress as much or as easily. And a nut and a spring lock washer. I had to take the bed off to... Uh, no, I didn't have to take the bed off, but it will make it easier. And then a uh, printed uh, adjusting wheel lock that I got from uh, Cults, but I think you can get it on Thingiverse too. If I can find it, I will put a link in the description. So uh, I'll show you basically how it's done and uh, without taking the bed apart. And uh, you can go from there, okay? All right, this is going to take some visual visualization on your part because I'm not taking my bed apart. I just got it dialed in and it's been not needing adjustment for months now. So apparently this does work. When I tried originally to put the um, bed locks of uh, screw locks on in one way or another, it took a while, but I finally figured out that the screws were spinning freely in the bed. They're just uh, countersunk screws like these. These are not, uh, this isn't uh, one of the screws, but it's similar. Um, I think they're uh, four millimeter uh, M4 screws. So um, you'll want split washers and nuts to match. And what you do is once you uh, take the bed off, you take the uh, adjusting screws off, lift the bed up, and then um, underneath you'll put spring washer on and make sure it fits between the uh, element lines for the heater. And then put on a single screw. Unfortunately, the one screw I have that's similar is uh, has got some messed up threads. Okay, so you run a nut all the way up to the washer and try to have uh, wrenches or an adjustable wrench to fit. Then you put on the spring, the, uh, sorry, and you put on a, um, another nut and then a second nut and you use wrenches of some kind to tighten them together. Then it becomes a jam nut and it's like a wrench attached to the threads. So from there you just want to uh, hold on to the bottom nut with a wrench and then tighten this down at the bottom against the spring washer so it won't come loose on the bottom of the bed. After that, you take these off again and you reassemble it with the new springs. If I can get this baby to work. There we go. I'm hugging my uh, tripod here, so try not to knock it over. So this will be protruding from the bottom of the bed. Stationary, it won't turn now. So then you put your spring on. And then you drop it down through the uh, carriage on the bed and you put your adjusting nuts on. Well, if you use the uh, adjuster locks that I use, you put them on first and then you put the nut on. And it um, has a spring that hits all the detent bumps on the outside of the wheels or the adjusting nut wheels and it holds it in place. And I've had mine on there for, mm, I don't know, six months, five months. And after getting it 
dialed in, I haven't had to adjust it in probably three months. And uh, it works quite well. So um, I'll put a link in. I, I really don't want to disassemble it to find out, but from what I could tell, the screws coming out of the hotbed are M4. So to do this, you'll want four springs, unless you want to stay with the old ones. And you'll want six M4 nuts, smallest ones you can find on the uh, outer dimension, and four, four uh, split washers to go under the nut. Two of those six nuts are just used to hold the screws stationary while you tighten the nut against the spring washer. And that's it. It's really pretty easy. And anybody with a um, um, even a little knowledge of doing anything mechanical, unfortunately I only had one wrench that would fit the uh, nuts because these are an odd size. Um, so um, yeah, that's pretty much it. It's not hard to do. It's easier than the uh, than what I did um, in the video that the guy who asked about this uh, saw it in. So. Uh, hopefully it was helpful. There's another video I'll link to where an, another guy did the same thing, basically. And uh, he did it the hard way, in my opinion. But you can look at it as well and uh, see what you think. Maybe you can use some of his information and some of mine. So good luck. Have fun.